since his election in 2004, joining Brother Jim Wires in the Arizona House, Jerry Wires has been working to help returning veterans. He now heads the Military Affairs Committee. Yeah, Jerry's one of those people that have made huge differences, especially within the veterans. Uh, and because it's become a passion, and passions are not turned on and off. Passions are something that really truly go to the very essence of who you are. He has organized job fairs, met with veterans from all branches, and been a hero for organizations like the Military Families Foundation, which helps resettle veterans in need. He has always been there. For example, we had a house donated to us out in Buckeye. And he was there to help and support us through that process of not only finding the family, but getting the items to go into the house that were needed. Uh, came out and was, was a keynote speaker at the event for the public uh, relations side. And he's always been there. When a truck was needed for the group, Jerry was there to help. Well, we needed a truck because of helping them move. A lot of them didn't have transportation. Well, I'm sitting in his office, and the next thing I know, I hear him saying, what, well, do you have another vehicle, truck, that you could uh, donate to a very worthy not? I mean, I almost fell off of the couch because it's not something that we were just talking about. It's something that we had talked about a month or so ago that just immediately triggered in his mind and he went ahead and asked the question and got when we wind up with a, a vehicle. He even got the U.S. flag back up at the Capitol after a storm bent the flagpole, which stood bare for months. And he said, oh, what kind of budget do I have? And I said, none. Now, I was joking. Uh, he took me to heart. Uh, and I think in the end, the total cost for fixing the flagpole minus two feet uh, was the cost of a pizza that we paid for for some of the people and a can of gray paint so that it would look as good as if it had never been touched. Uh, so we were into a poll for less than $20, $25 when uh, state government in its incredible uh, wisdom had already quoted somewhere about $25,000. An avid motorcyclist, Jerry Wires arranged for DPS escort for 2010's Run for the Wall, a 10-day cross-country ride to Washington, D.C. to call attention to veterans' causes. Jerry joined the ride, and at the Vietnam Memorial Wall, gathered names for families back in Arizona. You're the person that from your heart and your soul, you deserve this, and I'm so proud of you, and I'm just so proud to know you.